Hello, everybody. Oh my gosh, we're here. And we've got some pretty greens today. Oh my gosh, I feel like um, the tray is, isn't it just so pretty? I know you ladies have a bunch of these and I wanted to bring in a couple of the beads today, but I wanted to give everybody a shout out. We'll give it a little bit of time getting everybody in here, but I hope you're having a beautifully blessed day. And um, boy, we have been processing a bunch. Hey, Lori K. Gross, how are you? Gross, I wonder if it's gross. I think it's gross. Gross, okay, sense. okay. But well, I guess you'll let us know. Okay, I don't, I'm like, okay. It's, it, isn't that funny when I get here, I'm thinking, Holly Fleming and Leanne, how are you doing? Are you at work, Leanne, or are you driving? <laughs> Sometimes she's driving home from work. Holly, always so great to see you. And Marie, hello, hello, beautiful people, everybody out there, right? I know we're so lucky to have so many amazing people with such beautiful hearts inside and out, outer beauty, right? Miss Barbara Bihar. Oh, look, at she's got her little picture. I don't think you've had, has she had her picture on here before? I'm so um, excited to see her. Barbara? Yeah, yeah I gotta go see that. I feel like, is that new? Lisa Toward, how are you? Let me scroll up. Teresa Amen and Gina Thibodeau. You know, I, that had definitely had that pronunciation. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Jessica Brown is here. Andrea Jennings, how are you doing today? She's saying hi to everybody. Linda Samples, oh, so great to see you. We love your necklace stack always. Like, she has the best necklace stack ever. Lori says it's like 144 degrees where she is. What? So no. I, probably not literally 144, but uh, Oh, yeah, well, if it is, that, that's, don't go outside. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Rosemary, how are you doing? Becky, oh my gosh, hi. Derica, hi. I still like love that one post when she won that we posted. Oh yes, she was at the ocean behind. I thought, mm -hmm. oh, what a beautiful place to be. Annie, hi. I mean, she, Annie says hi mm -hmm. <laughs> to Mickey too. Uh, pulling in my driveway. Leanne was driving. Oh, that's too funny. That's too funny. <laughs> that's so funny because I'm like during that time. Sometimes she is. And Teresa Jory, how are you doing? You're killing me again. Okay, I know we're, we're getting some really beautiful things in, but you know why? Because you ladies keep telling me what you want, and you I keep, just you keep making so it and bringing fun. it in. I know, Nikki, it's so fun to to really see what you, you ladies want to see, and of course, my translation of it. Oh, Tanya, whoever else is on, um, Amy, how are you doing? She, yes, Michelle's actually getting ready to leave. This is her time. They kind of, uh, she leaves early and she gets to enjoy uh, the weather, especially this time of the year. So Mickey's here with yes, me. Yes, I'm here, hello. And you got my team here too. So um, we just finished uh, looking at some gorgeous London blue topaz. Mm -hmm. I rejected half of it though. Really? And then the tanzanite. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, there was about a quarter that we were able to keep of that. So anyway, yeah, it's tough. The gemstone rolled out there. Uh, it's, oh, 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 and Ola's here too, and Maria, how are you doing? Oh, I might be behind on my thing here, Mickey, huh? Lynn Johnson, Shipman, hi. Oh, Miss Brandy Hahn, look at that. I think I, you're ahead of me. Oh, my <laughs> 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 like <laughs> Erica, oh my gosh, Erica, how are you? Oh, Beverly Ar Armstrong, Hans, oh, I was thinking, I did, um, when I saw Ruby's necklace, did you get her one of those? It's so pretty with her stack. Because I was like, I could have sworn I saw Beverly with that necklace. So did you hook her up, Beverly? <laughs> I love it. Um, yeah, the how light is so fun. Um, uh, Michelle Lake is here today, too. Well, welcome in, everybody. Patricia Hayes. Oh, my gosh. Oh, Doreen Campino, too. And Sharon Richardson. Oh my gosh. We have an Joanna Molina. T Victoria. Way. What is it? Uh, Anne wants to know how you clean the cleaning cloths. Oh no. <laughs> Those don't, but they keep cleaning. So when you have that on there, they still work. Oh, okay. No, they can be totally like so black mm -hmm. and they still work. Uh, but then at one oh. point you get a new one. Yeah, but eventually mm -hmm. they run out. But yeah. no, it's crazy. It still polishes the jewelry up. Like we have some <laughs> that are so black that I'm like Throw it away because I'm weird about it, but mm. it literally says you can keep using Continue it. it. Mm -hmm. okay. yeah. Interesting. But it is because it's going to get off that, that stuff that you can't see on your jewelry, really. Mm. Um, April is here too. Tracy Burris. Oh my gosh. Clarissa Brown. Oh my gosh. I love it when you guys pop in just so that I can see your name. 
and then I get busy showing Vero. Hi, Vero. Oh my gosh, I didn't, I haven't seen you in a couple, like, you know, I only pop in twice a week to be able to read your names. Otherwise, I'm just showing you the jewelry all the time. Um, so this is fun for me doing the pop-ins because I get the little iPad and I get to focus just for a small minute on all you ladies, Sandy and I, Deborah Nunes. Um, hi, Lisi. Oh my gosh, look at, there's some new ladies here. Michelle Shepard, hi. Marisol, oh my gosh, Marisol, I have to tell you, your post, like, with the critter jewelry, um, you just look so good in your post. Like, I still have a couple on my picture book where you just wear it so beautifully. And um, Kim Deary, Jody's here, Donna Kelly, Ka oh, Catherine, okay, Ferris, hi, you? I'm kind of excited. Yeah. Okay, yay, I got through the names so far. Yeah. So this is wonderful. Nikki, yeah. um, we have, we've been hustling and bustling here at the yes. office. But, Getting um, a lot of new debuts and stuff in, but we're gonna focus on some last chance stuff today. Oh my gosh, resort. last chance ladies. Um, we're gonna be doing some crazy, crazy stuff in last chance. So, um, because we've got to make room for the new. Um, yeah, so we're gonna have we're gonna have some fun, but it's also hard if it, we sell down to two or three, they kind of sit around. So we're gonna be doing some really great, great things. Mickey, where are we gonna start off from? Because um, I'm thinking, um, okay, actually, if I look, that might be easier. Yeah, because so Mickey can do. Right? Yeah, so yeah. let's go with the leaf by. Oh, and okay, before we uh, really get started, we should tell them about the coupon that we have today. Oh, okay. Thursday ten get some ten percent off any last chance items. Uh, $100 minimum spend, use it as, or no, $50 minimum spend, you lowered it today. You really gave them the chance to really go wild. So it's a much slower spend, so you can use as much as you want and take advantage because it ends tonight. I love you know, not too many limitations. Yes. Okay. So I'm popping around my hand, kind of, I think I have a seven. And this is fun though, because it really, you can open it up and wear it however you want to wear it. Like it's just curved just beautifully. But do you saw how I kind of pulled it apart? There's yeah. a little bit, you know, you can play with it and get it to the size that you want. But this is so pretty because it actually has the granulation work that's on it too. But then you get a little bit of that high polish that makes it just so fun. Yeah, I'm always looking for that perfect twist. I think I like it right there. <laughs> <laughs> I just have to. Okay, so what do we have on that, Mickey? Fifty nine ninety nine. You did an amazing deal on that, and they can use the Thursday ten to get the discount because it's just over the fifty dollar minimum. Oh my gosh! Okay, because we put it on last chance. What yes. what department? It's last. just in last chance, which yep. I love it because sometimes we're working or we're not able to do a second size, so we're going to retire it and then work on some additional sizes. But I love this is this one has a lot of girth to it, ladies. Like it is a substantial bracelet. But it has this scattered fringe of panty, and I just love this. But this is one that was always priced quite high. Like, very, you saw this style out in the real world, right? Ladies, for over 220 most all the shows. Yes. Like, it was just a little bit more. Yeah, and you have two sizes in that bracelet. Uh, oh, the smaller one is a six to seven inch fit, and the larger size is a six and three quarter to seven and a half inch fit, and those are $149.99. On last chance so this is the bigger one so I love that and so do we have this uh, we do have the size and fit oh we just went over that yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay thanks Mickey so the two sizes and then um, I guess we've gotta have earrings so let's yeah. put some earrings here so um, oh yeah let me measure those now ladies this is a pretty nice weight you know I always like to be honest this is, I'd say a medium weight uh, with these but I'm gonna give you a little measure first just so you can see them. But all of this is gonna be in the last chance and we've moved it to the top of the page. So when you pop on there, it's just gonna make it really easy for you to find it. Now, you know these shows, ladies, um, on our big shows on Tuesdays and Fridays, you always see my face and we also do the jewelry like this, right? But on Wednesday and Thursdays, it's an opportunity to give um, really low prices. There's usually only two of us doing the show here with you. And um, we just really tour the jewelry. So that's what we do. What do we got on those earrings? Those Thank earrings, $59.99, and we're pretty limited in stock. So those are some you should definitely pick up. Those are really, really cool earrings. I kind of feel like this one could go with this too. Cause like sometimes when I do a flower day, 
I love it on this ring because I love how it just spans out, but it's pretty when you wear it because it really does span out like on your fingers really beautifully. Even if you put them together, it works. See? But I kind of like these together, Mickey. This has just been one of those really fun rings that I have. Um, that's super affordable. But really cool design. I really like it. Yeah, and it's $49.99 on last chance and we've got people who have That's been picking up some of those uh the rings that you put on last chance so they're super excited about the discount that see you I, this probably this is a look for under a hundred dollars yeah. once you use the discount right yeah so what i like with that because like today's kind of a hotter day like if you want to open this up just a little bit more and loosen that up i just want to kind of mention see you can kind of play with that to get that to um, mold so don't be afraid of that okay to open that up yeah, we got a couple of comments. Kim Deary loves the flower ring. Uh, Amy Long loves it and wears it often. Michelle Fle uh, Shepherd loves the flower ring. Oh my gosh, right? It's it's kind of one of those unexpected that you probably stick it with a lot of things. You're like, that actually really looks good today. I love it with this though. It's, I love the kind of the larger flower and then kind of playing off the fan in the the jewelry that I design. But we always need a pendant. This one's special because I made it reversible. And my artisans literally, um, I worked with them. I first did the front and then said, I'm gonna make another piece. So if you notice, see how it's domed? I actually did it to where it would be reversible. So I started playing with my galleries because you know that's my kiss to you. But I was like, okay, what about making the galleries full on like reversible pieces? Can't do this to everything, but man, this is, just one of those really, really beautiful pieces. Yeah, and you had placed, uh, priced it at $99.99 today. Another one that is extremely limited in quantity. See, I love this one. This one will take a little bit more time. It's a little harder uh, for my artisans to make. So like, we do a reorder on this one, it's a little bit harder, so. Barbara says it's great being reversible. Oh. <laughs> we're good. You wanna go to oh, the look, lab? Oh, yeah, the, the Para Eva. Para Eva. Yeah, Why not? You know, it's so funny because, you know, I do the frangio panties and stuff. I'll do a theme. So I love my frangio panties. I, my favorite probably is sometimes the greens that I'll wear with it because I'm like water, flower, um, foliage, you know, nature green. <gasps> okay. We actually have nothing coming this year left yeah. in the pair. Eva. Really? Uh -uh. No, because um, the color that came in, it was different. So we canceled and it is its own little person. I mean, it's got this soft, like almost blue green shade to it, but it's really spin out. That's what I love about it. So it's the Paraiba. So lab created, but they use the real seed of a uh, spinel. See, look at the frangipani too. And it's, yeah, it's just beautiful. It, love it. Oh, see, look at, and my favorite, these are the little frangipani. Um, and you don't see me setting. Make I, I tend to scent on points a lot. But these are really beautiful set like this. You know, a Christian square like this. But look at how beautiful they are. And the pennant you have for $89.99 and the earrings $129.99. Okay. And then you can use Thursday 10 to take 10% off the purchase. Oh, I love it. Okay, yes. I, that is just such a great little deal. Okay, if you like that soft shade, but I'm thinking this one too, Mickey. Um, my ladies love a good mystic. Yes, they love yes. a color. Um, this has just got like, personality like crazy on um and mystics um love to be with the opaque stones there's that rare chrysophase great like oh yeah. oh my gosh this one here is uh, ladies this is you couldn't get more high end with this chrysophase because this was from my really really high end putter um and this chrysophase it was in his showcase for 20 years like that's how he and, and I got to inherit him during COVID really? because he's like, you know, we got time. We're going to cut some stuff. Um, I know you've always tried to, you know, every year, do you want to make a deal? I said, make a deal. <laughs> yes, please. And the pendant you have at one nineteen ninety nine, and the earrings ninety nine ninety nine. And it's a great pairing. I love them. And you know what? This is the, um, the Odyssey Calypso. And the Odyssey Calypso is, look at the coloring in it. I mean, it's just so beautiful. And then you got your pre-night, of course. So pre-night, you know, I can't take orders on it. It's literally when I find it. And this was in my personal stash that I put into these collections. But yeah, I've got another multi that I'm going to show you too that it's it's pulls out more of the blues and the lavenders. 
Actually, I'm gonna take one of these earrings just so you can see the difference. <gasps> we never stuck the earrings that match this oh, on the wow. tray today. Uh-oh, ladies, I might have to find those for you because I wanted to do a really special deal on, uh, we have a stud earring that's phenomenal. But do you see the color difference where you get the blues and the greens with this a little bit more? And I use Prenite and Serpentine. Now the Serpentine, you know, I can't get anymore because it it's, comes in way too many shades, but it's really hard to get this translucent glow. So of course, it's not something you can cut, but it was something I scooped up. Like, so really rare materials actually with the Prenite and the Serpentine in this one, but the Cruciface, because it's so big, like, that it's this lady's is, piece. yeah, phenomenal. I mean, they're both so pretty. I don't know. <laughs> uh, well, it's with the cockatoo days that you just showed, that is one nineteen ninety nine. Okay, and again, I'm going to put the magnet enhancers. They're going to be fully finished backs, but these are those showcase pieces where this is your outfit. I mean, when you're going this many gemstones and stuff, Mickey, this is where I started is my love of gemstones, and I used to do... Just really beautiful. I call it my double bezel, double braid. Um, just really elegant. I think it's these are timeless kind of pieces, but then with these amazingly rare gemstones that you don't see in the market, especially if you see pre night, a lot of times you'll see it fully kind of translucent, super light, um, almost like light pond water. You know, not good. Yeah. So this glow yeah. that has the yellow behind it in the pre night, oh, so good, so good. And that one's one nineteen ninety nine. Okay, yeah, these are like I talked about the rarity, and then it's kind of silly when we are you going to the light? Well, and I'm telling you, uh, for the size of these earrings, these are ridiculous, and it's got my like my artisans. The little these are see they're all handmade, little graduated beads. But my favorite part, ladies, look at the little mini beads here going up, and the little look at the detail. How do they get that detail on there? It's amazing. It's amazing. And do you know none of them wear readers and glasses? Which yeah. I just don't even understand it. Like I'm it's, jealous. Yeah, I'm over there with all these different kind of readers making myself dizzy going back and forth <laughs> to the workshops. And yeah, it's just incredible. But anyway, these ladies, if you have any of my pre-night pieces, you got to get those earrings. Because again, I need every stitch that I had left, Mickey. In the so this, light, is, yeah. this is it. This is like last call on it. And those pre light earrings, uh, ninety nine ninety nine. But look at the colors. I mean, what would you not wear with that? The blues. So you're going to pull your blues. You're going to pull your greens out. But if you did, you had yellows, Mickey, this would be so pretty even with yellows, right? Because you see that green pulse some yellows. So beautiful. Oh, what's the sizing, though, on this bracelet? Look how easy this is, though, to put on. Yep, super easy. And it is a five and three quarter inch to seven and a half fit. So some range there too. And we have a question from uh, Shanti Lofton who wants to know where they can find these. And you can find these on Sarga.com and you just click on the featured tab and go to last chance. And all the items you're featuring there today should be at the top of the screen, but you can sort by newest and you should be able to find all of the things that we're featuring on the, on the tray today. And I'll drop the link in the feed here real quick too. So pretty though. Like, you know, you can just mix and match. This one is that really comfy, low profile ring that I do. It's all about the gemstone because that bezel has to be wrapped around the height of that stone, which is so beautiful. And look at, this is where it's gonna be that breathability, but that extra like piece, you just love wearing my pieces, right? Because you know the quality's there. But my kiss to you is saying, it's always going to be just like, Beautiful, awesome quality because you are valued, loved, and cherished. Do you know I have a special jewelry collection coming out to remind you ladies of that too. I, I can't wait. It's going to be later, probably in about two months. Oh. Well, for now, you can purchase that ring for $89.99. Oh, <laughs> you're loved. But, and Chanel can keep telling you that you're loved and cherished and yeah. valued. How's that? <laughs> Okay, so um, I, I went over this part here. So let's go to the uh, blonde lead in. <coughs> this is a mystic quartz. My cough is getting worse, isn't it? My voice is getting worse. I don't know, ladies. Okay, <clears throat> ladies, has this always been our favorite? That's why I moved this over here. Because I've been dying. Do you know I've never lined these up to sell them together? Oh, that is such but a I great designed look. all these at the same time. Yeah. Isn't that crazy? So I'm like so excited. But again, see, look at... If you see mixing with this, oh wow! That is see the cockatoo incredible. days, and you can really mix these together. That's why with this set, 
You don't always have to go so matchy match. Oh, look how pretty that is. It, uh, you know what, Mickey? We gotta do more. I've gotta do an. I need to do more of these because this literally, ladies, we might not have everybody signs. I love the cut on that one. But it's like I gotta do more of this. Oh my gosh! I know too many designs in my head, too many styles to run as it, it is. It really pops with each that. of the individual. So pretty, stones. right? Look at that. Yeah, that is an outfit. I mean, I gotta be honest, after all this, I'd be going for this set because like, I just love this because of the cursive face. So if you got the cursive face bracelet, ladies, you should be getting that. But this is, I mean, no, you're gonna grab this over and over and over, especially if you've got like a lot of prints, but any of your solid, I could see this doing it with like taupes, tans, olives, also going in that kind of earth tone color, browns, like this to me looks, like very more, see, like you can mix up your seasons. Okay, so. Well, the ring, you... yeah, you put the ring at an amazing price, seventy nine ninety nine. So pretty, right? Yeah. Okay, so then the next thing we've got, um, I want to go it? to the crackle. There it is. Yeah. I knew I had it somewhere. Okay, well, I love crackle because you can also add some personality, right, into that. So you can mix and match your greens, but. Crackle quartz I love because it's natural quartz. What we do, it's genuine crystal quartz, and they heat it to get this like really cool crackly pattern. Yeah. So it's like a lot of it doesn't make it through it. So, but it just is just really cool. Crackle quartz, shattered quartz, you see that like it's just really big right now. People are really having fun experimenting. And look at that. Is that the Bali Crush that I used? I think it is. Or which, which yeah, was the Bolly Crush. That's right. Okay, I love Bolly Crush. I gotta use more of that. Okay. And that one's seventy nine ninety nine. And I kind of like that. Maybe going into the Prezio lights too. So if you didn't want to go so exact, look how pretty that is with it, right? I love a facet and kind of almost like an opaque patterned together. I like those together too. Those are really pretty. Yeah. Now let's go to the Elite Elite Prezio light. Yes. But. I only brought the edgy, edgy stuff in tonight, ladies, because you ladies that have like a personality and you like a little bit more edge, look at, I took, I created silver pieces and then connected them. So this, it's just such an like wearable art. Um, but let's talk about the Prezio light because that is the elite of gems, like always represents kind of high end Mickey and just, you know. Oh, mm -hmm. Ioni's here. Hi, how are you doing? Okay, so um, again, so. That design is just an incredible. I love that design. Did I? Oh, I didn't do a ring. Oh, no, I didn't bring an appraisal light. Okay, so, well, that's where you mix, you can mix in your silver. So, you know what? Because it's just like that, maybe what I would do is just wear your really cool silver pieces, right? Um, mixing like this or adding on like this, because you know me, I'm an adder on her. <laughs> okay, so now. I think we have just one size left though. And only in the a bracelet. couple of them. Only okay. a couple of them. So I know it was getting down there, but um, just a really cool chic design. Oh yeah, this is not my size, but I'm just gonna try it on to see, but that's really not gonna make sense. Okay, love the openness of it. But when we get that small, do you see that silver right there? Those are all individual galleries that have to be done separately. And then when they apply the heat to it, they can't, they have to be so careful, otherwise the silver can, uh, and the solder will melt it. Oh. So when you go into those fine spaces like that, and I love making something really contemporary with my signature bezel, but then you still are gonna get that really beautiful finishing on the inside. And that bracelet, it has a fit of six and a half to seven and three quarters, and you priced it amazing price, $199.99. See, look at that. Uh, Prezio Light's such a neutral color. It just goes so beautifully with just so many things. Um, man, yeah, the earrings, yeah. I can't believe I kept color. Now, when you cut and you do the over 300 facets, when you do these fancy stones and you're able to still capture color of Prezio Light, ladies, they sell a lot of almost white. It almost looks white and they call it Prezio Light. So I'm super proud of the color that I'm able to deliver. Um, Prezio Light is meant to be a very lighter color. Yeah. You see some people call it green amethyst, but it was, I mean, it got its own name, Mickey, because it was such a special find in gemstone. 
So praseolite is the proper terminology, but you do see some people calling it green amethyst. Yeah, oh, interesting. I did not know that. And that one's ninety nine ninety nine. Oh my gosh, that's... For I love the, trying to come cut, too. Right? Yeah. Well, in these kind of stones, too, you could pay over 100 bucks just for one stone, really. You know, when you look at different fancy cuttings, a faceted is much more affordable in the market yeah. than, you know, and then they have, they limit the faceting to it. Okay, well, this will be oh, my yeah, last more. piece yes. on the tray. Because, you know, I'm crazy about jerseys, but I'm crazy about jerseys that do multiple colors. So with mine... As it turns, you're gonna see different colors. And people came in and did the druzies and did really, really cheap druzies. And um, I only use the sugar crystal druzies, like only the highest quality. And you can see you're gonna get more three to six colors, depending on what light you're showing in my druzies. You see, you're getting that pinky lavender. Yeah, I was about to see like a purple maybe, so I like purple. Did you see the green mm -hmm. and then the dark blue that comes in too? And so I knew, I, of course, I wanted to accent our favorite, most popular gem, our, our topaz right now, is our Bali High. It's exclusive to us, only at Sarda. You're only going to get it from us. So I, I'm kind of excited about that topaz. And then, of course, I think it's the Bali Crush again. Would I? Because there's two that are very similar. Yeah, yeah Soaring uh, Skies, Druzy, Valley Crush, and then Valley High. Okay, yeah, it is the Bali Crush still. So it's the same one that's in the, uh, but this is, um, this is why I want to switch the back. See the what this, these are all done by hand. You see where we've soldered them to the edge? So this one is called granulation work. Every single one you see suspended. And I like to do an open filigree piece like this because this is what you see layered on to the top of a lot of the jewelry, see? like this. So you really get to see each and every strand. Um, again, a very, very special piece. There's not very many people in Bali doing this granulation work to this kind of scale, Mickey. It's, it's just truly, um, definitely, I'd say a collectible piece. Yeah, a museum. Museum. Piece. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And yeah. that one's ninety nine ninety nine. So absolutely pick that up, especially using Thursday at 10. You get that extra 10% off. I love it. You know what I did because I couldn't make up my mind? I did make two. So ladies, I did it with the green, but I also have the same version on Last Chance with the Royal Bali and the Sheer Luck. So I did it with the blue because see how this picks greens and blues? I did them both. So you get a choice. Today I'm just showing you this one, but if you're a blue girl and you want the blues pulled out of the Soaring Skies druzy, go you can find it yeah. on the page. Yeah. Okay, let's go into the beads, and I yes. think that's it. Oh, sorry, ladies, didn't mean to make you dizzy. Okay, you saw how pretty this one is. I, this Hubie Turquoise one is just a great little necklace because it just matches with so much stuff. So I use the Hubie Turquoise. Um, also, um, this is the, is this the green onyx? Read the, the beads to me, would you please? Uh, oh, see. there we go. Yes, yeah, the green onyx, the freshwater pearl, the silver-plated hematite, and the green onyx and light green jade. Okay. So we got a lot. So, Hubie, the green turquoise, and then it is green onyx, but you know what? I do want to show you. It actually has the celestial over it, which is kind of cool. It looks like the rainbow peridot quartz that I do, actually. Oh my gosh, if you got that pear one for me, wouldn't that be pretty to put that pendant on? Oh my gosh, the crew. Oh my gosh, I may have to bring this necklace back in next week. <laughs> okay, and then let's do this one because this one is this is a. I wanted to do it. This is on braid, green onyx. Oh, I think I just I I mixed them up because that uh, the one you just showed was not on my sheet. So now you are showing the green onyx, the freshwater. No, uh, yep, the freshwater pool, uh, the hematite, and the green onyx. Okay. This is just that sweet little one that you wear up by your neckline. I think it's so appropriate for the summer, these cute little yeah. sweet little necklaces mm -hmm. like this, you know? And um, yeah, just love it, the hematine. So how do we make our necklaces? They're all strung on silk thread. Okay, do you see that little knot? We string and we hand tie. These are knotted, okay, super. Like, nobody does that in the industry anymore. You're seeing it on Tiger's Tail. 
And what happens when it kinks with tiger's tail, it can stay kinked and it's never really gonna lay straight. With these, it's silk. So as you wear it, it gets softer and softer and just truly, th this is what um, white pearls and all yeah. those expensive ones so are, are hand done, you know? So that is our first tray. So I am going to go into our second. And I just really kind of wanted to keep it really, uh, like just kind of true to form with some other greens, but last call on the amylite. Okay. So one thing, you know, cause I just looked at the price you did on that necklace. Oh yeah. And I just want that so they know what kind of price you're getting on this. Oh, this one? Yes, $49.99. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah, that's, that's I had to show that again I, just you know what, because of the This price. one is so cute on because of the pearl. Now these are those really oversized peanut pearls that I was collecting over the years and decided to put them in. So being as big as this peanut pearl is, oh my gosh, Mickey, I'm glad you called it out. Yeah. Because this is, um, look at, this is almost, it's over a half inch. Oh my gosh. And the, I think the millimeter, I think it'd be like 10 millimeter, I think. Yeah, I think that's, yeah. Eight, maybe nine. Uh, yeah. Oh my gosh, no. So anyway, just for the pearl, um, I gotta tell you, yeah. for those bigger pearls, those are kind of harder to come by now. Oh, that is hilarious. I love this necklace. I, I love wearing this with my olive cords, to be honest. Like, it's so pretty. But that's why I'm loving the Mojave, too. But I want to get to these because, ladies, I know we're limited on size. So I want to get to... All of these are going to be true to size except for this one. Okay, I'm going to call out right away. Um, I'm going to tell you to size up in this one, okay? So this is a seven. Oh, I don't even have... She didn't pull me my size. This is a six. Okay, sorry about that. Um, this is such an elegant ring on. Yeah. Darnsy, darnsy. I wish I it fit me, ladies, uh, because it's such a pretty ring. But it's a three in one. And didn't I put this at just an incredible price? You did. I wish, I wish this one looks, I own this one. So I like own it. I design all of it. I just <laughs> took it. I took it, ladies. I didn't own it. That Owning it would mean I paid, well, I did pay for it, but you not really. In a way, in yeah. a way. But the price you did as a steal, $89.99. Ooh, that's what the middies, I bet you people are actually stacking up the middies three in a row. How much? $89.99. Okay. Because I, I, it's just a really, really luxury. Like everything about it is just maxed out. So yeah, always been one of my favorite rings. So, um, oh, you gotta I, have, I have this bracelet too. Actually, this is that one ladies that just, um, was one of my first bracelets that I did started to do a little bit more fitted and the comfort I have a six inch wrist just so you know do we have two sizes in this movie? just one left <coughs> it, what uh, what size and is it it's six five which fits a five and a half inch wrist to a six and a half inch wrist that's me so it's yeah. gonna be a little bit more so I'm a six inch wrist so this is pretty much a I'd say six and a quarter inch wrist and down is is gonna be your perfect fit with this I love mine and I just I yeah I, it's just so comfortable and it really mimics the chain link of all of our hand woven chain still doing the um, ha high polish hammered but it's the architecture of this bracelet I think that makes it so much more of a statement can you see just that slight dipping of it which just like I said the architecture of it is just high-end luxury I mean and look at the gallery. Look how beautiful it, it is crafted by my artisans. I mean, seamless, just just perfect. Every time I pick up mine, like I just, I love wearing mine when I wear it. It's just, it's just, it really can be such a standalone piece. It's so high end, um, but I, I'm, I'm just a stacker. I'm, I'm yeah. addicted to stacking. I like multiple bracelets on my, it just feels good on my wrist, you know? I'm addicted to stacking, please. <laughs> Is there anybody out there that's addicted to stacking? Yeah. Oh my gosh, well, right? I have a feeling we'll get a few answers on that one. Okay, this is Amalite, okay? So you're going to get a lot of color play. So it's almost like Mother of Pearl sometimes. You see where, like, that, that chatoyant shade and where it changes? You know how, like, Mother of Pearl? Amalite literally was a fossil that was in the ground. It fossilized, but all of these minerals that soak through the water then went on to the, the, the fossil, which was that big snail, the amylite, and literally 
opalized into the most beautiful colors. And I use the Canadian um, from Canada. And it is truly the spectrum of colors in the Canadian Amalite is, is beyond anything um, that's out there. Um, I always, you know, I've got that champagne taste, ladies, but I go in and tell them I have a beer budget and I negotiate for you. So really some of the prices on this, it, it's... You've done some amazing prices um, on that ring specifically, $149.99. Only a handful left in that one. And the triplet you're showing, one nineteen ninety nine, and it looks like there's just one left. So, there's one ring? Yeah. Oh, well, that's... Okay, sorry about that. I wouldn't even have put it yeah. on. I'm sorry, <laughs> ladies. Uh, there's only one left. That's yeah. so rude. Okay, there was more when I pulled the tray together. Yeah, sorry about that. I'm sure they've been shopping, so... Okay, yeah. sorry about that. Okay, well, if there is, I, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's oh, awful. Yeah. Because then I'm like, I want it, I want it. How come I can't have it? So, okay, this is so cute with the little fringe panty. So this is the pear, and just really sweet and elegant. So um, what do we got on this one? Yes, we've got that pendant on sale for $129.99. And we have a question from Linda Samples who wants oh, to know yes. where else Amalite comes from. Oh, um, I, I only use the Canadian, oh. so I don't even remember where. It's, no, uh-uh, it's not there, sorry, Nikki. Like, <laughs> my poor little, uh, my whiteboard used to have so much good information on it, and it's just blanked out all the time. Um, no, I, I bet our know. stone team can find that. Yeah. We can answer that one for you later. But the, well, yeah, I'm the stone team, usually. I yeah. don't have the information <laughs> yeah. if I need it. You give them but the information. this is what's so sad, but I have it documented yeah. everywhere, so, like, I just does access just can you look up where I had it before? Mm -hmm. But we do not buy any. So our Amalite, I only use Canadian. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So I don't even remember where the other stuff, but if it's not, I and I have one resource that really gives me the top. Because blue and red, you will, it's not very common. A lot of times people say Amalite and you only get the yellow and the green. But I always, the blue I find is the hardest. Mm -hmm. Some people say red, but it's actually harder to get the blue in it. But blue and red, very rare. Most of the time you'll get it in light, you won't even have that color. Pretty common. Oh, this should have gone on the other tray because this is the pair of oh, yeah, okay. oh my gosh, so here's a second option. But oh my gosh, so pretty with any of the pieces. Um, but look at, I, you can even, if you want something a little bit more contemporary, look at, you could still mix it with this bracelet too. How pretty, right? If you're more smaller and contemporary, if you didn't want all that big gem, uh, but yeah, so this one, Mickey? Yes, yeah, sixty nine ninety nine. Oh wow, yeah. that's really great. Okay, yeah, yeah and it's the cut. Yeah. So sometimes, that was kind of a standalone piece. I didn't have a big collection. I think a really, a, a, in shape for pendants, emeralds are so beautiful. <gasps> okay, here's my find. This all is this is all me, everybody knows, Hayward Muse, all of quartz. Those are ones I cannot, like, I, to me, it's money. Whenever I see this on somebody, the olive quartz is just expensive, rich looking. So I did it in a super contemporary piece. Um, even look at, even on this, I did a twisted cable look on the bail. Um, twisted cable, just something that would just be timeless and classic. But this is a X step cut. So this is again a cut by my competition guys. Look at this. Look at the shape of it. Look at the table facet. Um, just elite, elite. So um, there's not much left in the olive, like yeah, but just a few. Trust and me, it's eighty nine ninety nine. So you definitely want to go and grab that one. But you see why I love this beaded necklace, like with the olive. And I'm going to bring the olive back in. But even with the amylite, look how fun this is with the amylite, huh? Um, and I love the the length of this necklace too. Um, but the quality is phenomenal. And this is the Mojave turquoise, that um, bead that I had. And I had like about 40 of them, ladies. So I made 40 of these necklaces using just the bead. So that I had cut up with this material. So I love it. And this is the green jade. These are freshwater pearls. I, these are little button pearls. They're so cute. And I love the rose gold with it. I just think it's kind of unexpected. But... With all the marbling, it just looks so gorgeous with our silver, though. Look at Yeah. I mean, it's just like a natural fit. But just that warm pop of the rose gold um, bead, 
I think it's just so pretty, right? Yeah, and that's a 20 inch necklace with a one and a half inch extender, $79.99. Well, and I've got my swivel, um, my Bali, my Janela Dare uh, clasp. So yeah, you're gonna get two inches of extenders with that. So yeah, again, still knotted on silk. Look at that, see? And do, I can't even tell you how much silk I had to buy in the different colors just to match all my beads because I'm crazy about it. They wanted to do it on white. I was like, it just looks cheap. I wanted yeah. a really elevated necklace. So I did try to keep with the same colors on this, the, the silk ladies. Um, I, you know, just a little differences. From, yeah. Oh, yes, uh, yes, please. Barbara Baker wants to know if the green uh, jade bead pieces <clears throat> are dyed. The jade, yes. All the jade is dyed. Yeah, most of the jade in the beads, um, I always say it's dyed. Even if somebody tells me it's natural, usually there's some kind of heat or something. So yeah, I, I, I do. I, um, when it's consistent like that, um, it's really hard to get something that is not dyed in jade anymore. It to, to be honest. So, um, yeah, I don't, um, just, yeah, just unless you're paying like four digits for your jade. It's and probably it's got a some. super respectable, it, it most likely it has been colored, yeah. it, you know, dyed, to, to, to be honest. Oh, and just as a reminder, tonight is the last night to take advantage of our B10 discount. Get 10, uh, use B10 to get 10% off your beaded purchase of $100 or more. And everyone who purchases a beaded piece uh, gets entered into a drawing for a Janelle uh, selected gift. Oh my on. gosh, I know I'm having trouble because I was like, oh, yes, yes, we're going today. over it today. And I was <laughs> like, no, I'm going to do this and I want to do this, but wait, if we do more later, I don't want anybody to feel bad if we don't do this all the time. Mm, and yeah. I'm struggling. I'm like, I don't like it when they have me decide because I'm like, <laughs> I want to give a hundred dollar gift certificate so they can pick. So it might come down to that because I'm like, I just don't know it. Anyway, I wish that I'm showing peanut wood. There's only a couple pieces of the peanut wood left. I wanted to show that with the peanut wood. Ladies, this is like the last of it. But if you have any of the peanut wood, this was the largest piece I had cut so far. And the patterning is so phenomenal. Now, peanut wood's coming from Australia. So it's literally petrified wood. And the reason they came up with it these little guys burrow and eat in these like really cool holes and it's fossilized in there, the sand, the silt. Then like, you know, centuries later, they dig it out and go, wow, look the patterning, everything on it. But Australia is the only one that has this that's called peanut wood. So just really, really cool. Yeah. And there's only a few of those left and you priced it at $79.99. So yeah, we buy the rough and cut all the peanut wood. So I just... Like really special. Um, a lot of it is you cut into it, you don't get patterns and stuff. So, like the, the rough is one of those ones you don't see it that much because historically it's been kind of expensive. Yeah. Um, um, rough to to accumulate and buy. Okay, so Mickey, I think I'm going to finish out the Mojave yeah, because absolutely. really I have two different pieces um, of this and. Um, I'm going to be bringing in a lot of jewelry. Man, I have some really special things, ladies, that are going to be combined. But my favorite, again, is going towards the olives, the citrines. Um, you know, I'm doing a collection actually coming up that's going to have the um, peaches and cream opal mm. that mixed with this Mickey. So beautiful. I can't wait. I just QA'd the jewelry. It's so beautiful. But Did you do that before and it like sold out? Pretty much immediately. No, I, I did oh. the pe yes, yes, the solid peaches and cream. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, yeah. But I brought in a multi, like Ooh, seven stone. Okay, that's so gonna be. We, that's also gonna go we just looked at it one. downstairs, and all my employees, I'm like, you are not allowed to pre-shop on this, because like, <laughs> they're like, we have to have one. I said, uh, uh, no, no, no. Okay, so this is gonna be your two options. They're really, you know, one's kind of edgy, more contemporary, and then this is your go-to classic, classic, but. If you've got beads, you've got a bunch of other stuff, but I, I love to mix in some rose gold and gold with this too. I think it is just so pretty with it. Okay. And so, you've got uh, both of those versions. Uh, the one with the, the bail is $79.99, or $99.99, and then the Mojave green and bronze pendant that you just showed is $79.99. 
Now we're down to, uh, there's like literally a handful. What was there? Yeah, like five was, pieces left yeah, or something. Yeah, there were not many of that ring But left. we wanted to show that with all your greens, look at, look how pretty, right? They're going to intermix with all of them. So we want to remind you why the Bali High is so popular because it literally mix, mixes and matches with all your greens, your blues, your, you know, like so beautiful. And you see all the, the change of the colors, why it's so popular. You get teals, you get chromes, you get peridots. Ooh, I got some pretty peridot coming. Oh, Ooh. we have several questions wanting to know when the peridot is oh coming my gosh. in. So you know, I happen to know. So, I'm yep, we're already looking at the stones. We're already, like, procuring them. Now we got to make the silver around it. So it's still going to be about three months. Okay. Well. We're trying to rush it, but the stones, like, yeah. Still um, working on procuring the stones. Yeah, uh, the Bally High. You just showed that there are only a few left of forty nine ninety nine. So uh, obviously limited sizes. So go pick that one up in, in less chance. So these are those really really great classics. So I should have showed this earlier with the bracelet, but like you mix in two chain link pieces like this. I mean, you see that like statement that it makes. So maybe you wear the gemstone pendant the silver bracelet, and you pick just a silver earring like this, it's got that swing, that movement. The classic pieces that you buy like this, that, and then they have the quality. The weight on this is fabulous too, but I love that it has the watermark on the back, chain link on the front. So you can really, you know, I use those two patterns a lot, and you can mix and match these. But these are always at an everyday great price. Like my quality on my silver, really hard to 89. match. 89 great price. Right. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'm going to grab the last two. These are kind of my signature pieces. This is the one I wear on my thumb. Whoops, I don't have it for my thumb today, but I usually wear that on my thumb. This one here, I always say you can size up, ladies, um, if you want, um, but read what it says. I, I have three sizes in this because I wear it on my thumb in different ones, but I think she might have given me an eight. Nikki, can you, um, we double check the website because yes, if this is an eight, I, this one, I always suggest to slice up. So ladies, I don't know. You can tell me on there if it is or not. Right. But this is my best selling earring. I've done it in hammered. I've done it in flat jawline. I've done it in tree of life. Janelle Adair, um, frangipani. So anyway, is this the one where we're tearing the Janelle Adair and keeping the frangipani? No, I can't remember. I did this last time, didn't I, ladies? I can't remember which one we're doing. <laughs> but anyway, always ahead. Always yeah. so lightweight. So, ladies, you want that drama earring, but lightweight, you go for these styles because they're they're fabulous. Yeah, and they're $69.99. You did a crazy price. Oh, my gosh. Yes. This is good. This is good. And then you use <gasps> Thursday 10, you get an additional oh, uh, think that's a amount. Great price. Of, yeah, that's a... Mm -hmm. Do you see the, the design? Like, yeah. And I got to show this ring because this is the one, like I said, I have three sizes. I love it. But I always say size up. So I actually, I always wear a nine on my thumb. I have a 10. And it's, it's just whenever you go wider in a scallop, I've been trying to size them, ladies. But this is one I've been carrying for a long time before I had, um, when I was in the industry, they make me make everything. Okay. It goes on a ring size or it says it's an eight. It's an eight. But when you have different widths and stuff like that, it doesn't always fit as an eight. But I know I prefer, if I know I'm an eight, I want to buy an eight from my favorite designer all the time. I don't want to have to like, oh, she's saying maybe to go up. So I'm starting to size, meaning I could never sell them out in the industry anymore because I'm going to size to fit. Okay. So nobody's doing that. Nobody wants to break the mold of that, but I want you to get these pieces home and be happy. So, um, it does with, not say size up on the website. So it doesn't. Yeah. Okay. I always size up on this. So, okay, so yeah, make this that one, note. please. I will make that change. And ladies, we figured out how to change it to where, oh, yes. before you check out, it's going to say, we rec started recommends to size up. Okay. So this is one that probably fell through the cracks because yeah. it was, um, um, it's a little bit older. Yep, now that we were yeah. on our own, we're trying to catch up and make everything just really enjoyable for you ladies. But yeah, we'll have it in a much more visible place going forward. Okay. So we're excited about changing that. Thank you, Mickey. So we'll change that right after the show. Yep. How's that? We will do it. Okay, so we've got all of this going. Um, oh, yeah, I've got to put this back on. Um, now we did some ways a night. And i got to tell you, ladies, we're going to do um, super low quantities on this. But 
last chance, okay? So this is that hand twisted cable um, that, I mean, my arsons, um, my family, literally, like, in Bali, everybody's related. So the ones that charge that super, super high end for doing the hand twisted mm -hmm. cables, I, the other half of the family is with me, in my family. So the quality, I'm telling you, is phenomenal. They, this is what they like shine at, what they do the best of. They're so good at the hand twisted cables. But Maurice and I, don't we just love it? I mean, Gorgeous. because we could never do diamonds in that option, but it's that one that replaces diamond, right? And the, the, the color play in it is actually better than diamond. So it's just really great to know that you have really elite gemstones like Maurice and I yeah. set in the best hand quality um, silver. And this is a six and a three quarter inch bracelet and it fits wrist sizes five and three quarters to seven inches. Just a handful left of this one. Yeah. And what, what, what's the size of fit though? Oh the yeah. Fit. The fit is five and three quarters to seven inches. Five and three quarters to seven inches. Yep. That makes sense. Yep. And two seventy nine ninety nine is the price you put on that, which is great for that kind of carriage in Moisenite. Right. I know. And we were thinking about redoing this with smaller stones next time. So, um, because we kind of... We kind of went Mac Daddy on. Yeah, yeah. So we're gonna try the, some the smaller stones. Put together, I know. Yeah. So it's like I know I'm like I just want a really great little cable. Now this I love this. We lost this for a while, so I'm so excited to bring it back. However, um, there's just a couple just a, so that we found. Maybe. Yep, yeah. there's two. But ladies, I love the length of it too, Mickey, because there's still that adjustability that gives you four inches of extenders on it. But it's just that perfect, sweet little length. Yeah. And what that one, sorry, I just lost yeah. my place because um, it's not on my sheet. It's, oh, it's a 16 it's inch. A, <gasps> thank you. Yeah. Okay, because I was going to say, wait a minute, this is my 16. But then I'm like, every time I think it's a 16, it's an 18. <laughs> so, ladies, you know how we want that? I wish I could put this one on so you could see it. It is so pretty on, but of course I'm under, there's no way, I'm not a contortionist. But <laughs> ladies, you know the 16, but I give you four inches, so it will go to a 20. But I love it because it gives you that option, and trust me, that cute little, like, right in your neckline, like, up higher, I love this. But do you know how much work this is, trying to get, see how I had to do, do the rings so that they all spread apart? All of that is done one by one by one by hand, like, crazy but just yeah. so beautiful I love the little double-sided end caps and that I went more contemporary too but that's that handmade chain every single little spine that's a little jump ring that's hand woven but that's this is the, the magic it gets silkier and silkier as you wear it like such I mean this is your forever heirloom piece Nikki yeah. I mean your forever yeah. forever piece with moissanite, mm -hmm. and there's only two left. Like you said, two ninety four ninety nine, and then you can use Thursday ten to get an additional ten percent. Yeah, if you're concerned, the bracelet, you the, the necklace, mm -mm. necklace, that is an incredible deal. Okay, so this again, oh my gosh, see, this is where I would do something like this, and I would usually wear my little thumb ring like this. So that's kind of my like signature. Love that together. Let's see, I could still put it over here. That's a great, great band ring at $99.99. You it's, and just a handful left of that one too. Mm -hmm. So just kind of going maybe without the gemstone, let's do something really elegant. So I'm gonna take this off because the moissanite, sometimes ladies, I just love going high end with the mm, silver that, and the moissanite. Classic look. It's just, yeah. you know, mm -hmm, I'll go a purist on this kind of stuff because it's just, yeah. I have my moissanite days where I'll, you know, stick in a few of my diamonds and stuff too, but yeah, and that uh, ring is a four millimeter, um, $89.99. Great price, and I love the design of it. I love the little scalloping, yeah. This one, and see, for me, where people would make this flat, do you see how I've curved this just like how your finger is? So I always, you're going to feel like I custom um, fit the, the items, but I want it to sit down low and tuck around where somebody's just going to make it flat, and that's the difference. You'll see the architecture literally just drapes around your fingers. That's what's important to me, that you're going to be comfortable, but it's going to like conform to your body, your, your shape, your real shape. Yeah, speaking of the band, uh, this is a personal question. Um, yeah. We're uh, the chain link 
ring that you did. Are we ordering more of those? Uh, the, the one, one I showed? Ring? You don't have it here today. <gasps> yes. Yes. Actually. my dad is looking at that one actually as a wedding band. Oh, no. Yeah. 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 Seriously? Oh, my mm -hmm. gosh. You know why, Mickey? It was so funny. Do you know today we just, the Moise and I chain link, um, bracelet that had the little button. Yes, she, yes. The, the oh, yeah, yeah, yes, yes. I added more sizes. Very nice. And so I just was approving the sizes. We rushed on that one because it was such, we kept, yeah, kept selling out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So anyway, I'm kind of excited. We're going to add more sizes to it. This is like my set that I love together because it's the little frange of panties. And we lost these. Remember I had the studs, ladies? Um, the little uh, stud pair. But... I love the um, French wire. So I was kind of excited. I'm like, I'm gonna have to show those again um, because they're just spot on. Now this is the biggest one we carry, ladies, and it's an eight millimeter moissanite. So when you go past into seven, eight millimeters, the price of moissanite drastically changes. It's just like diamonds. Yeah. You, you have to pay a lot more for them, but yeah, ladies, of course, we look at the hearts, look at all, everybody likes heart, and like, that's hilarious, because they're like, yes, yes. Um, yeah, so this is, like, one of the ones, um, yeah, it's I always... I the price on those earrings, $99.99. See? Amazing deal. And then the uh, pendant is two forty nine ninety. And I think it's a believable set, because it's like, yes, you know, I went smaller on the diamonds, but here's your big solitaire, like, amazing pendant. Um, but I wanted to do it in a classic style somewhat but still edgy like because my ladies aren't too classic boring they've got so much personality i i just want to bring a little bit more to to it but see again you get that cabling to me that bracelet i just I, this is where i love it and, and again you would you could just wear like this is enough to just maybe that's your look for the day and it's going to be a little bit more simple i mean you don't have to bling out like me but that could just be your look for sure Okay, one last pendant, Mickey, and then I think we have showed everything. I gotta put this back on, man. This is so Love wonderful. That. I mean, I'm Love like, that. it is so good. It's yeah. like, I do. I start the show naked on my hands, and then I start to stack up, but it's like, yeah. Okay, so again, last call on this one. So this is one we will be retiring. Um, I think these are actually the ones we are retiring. Yes. These are all ones we're retiring. I think that's what uh, we decided because we did a reorder on a bunch of stuff. So, yeah, truly last call re and yeah, retire. Just a couple of those left. So mm -hmm. ninety nine ninety nine on that pendant. Yeah. So it's yep. Yeah, because we, we, new styles we're making room for like new things as we do it and stuff. But that's the thing we were going to bring some new in, but then we needed some reorders too. So, okay, so we've got all those goodies. Okay. Well, ladies, if there are any questions or anything. Yes, we have Barbara. a question from um, Anne Marie Pelham. I believe that's right. Uh, she wants an ET on the kitty pieces that um, you previously talked about. The what cat pieces. Oh, the kitty pieces? Yeah. Uh, say it again. Oh, when are we going to see some more? <clears throat> oh, when are we going to see some more kitty pieces? Oh my gosh, I actually have some um, really cool new kitty pieces coming in gemstone. Um, oh, you know what? I am going to bring. Um, because the kitty sold out a couple of the white mother of pearl. I think it is in last chance. We are not bringing it back because they can't cut for us again. And my artisans, to be honest, it was really hard for them to set it. <laughs> so we won't be doing, but always going to be bringing kitty stuff in. Are you kidding? And um, I love that the kitty went out uh, today. You know, when you spend it, spent two fifty, they spent got the kitty, got which that was yeah, really cool. Yeah, we almost sold out. I think we did sell out of those. Yeah, maybe there's just a handful left. I think it. Beth came up and said there was five left. Yes. So that was it. And then we would have been done with that. Um, any other questions um, that we have? Yeah, Perido, is that coming back soon? Perido? Yes. Um, I know yes. I've got a bunch of collections in Perido coming, new debuts. Yes. Um, and I went bigger. Uh -oh. I, and <laughs> again. Just gorgeous stuff. So Perido is coming. <gasps> Wait a minute. I've got a special surprise on a necklace in Perido. Uh oh. Coming. Okay, uh -oh. so it's the one that I actually found in Tucson. Mm -hmm. And I have been sitting on it waiting. Really? So I made designed that magnet clasp mm -hmm. and that's what I just strung up. I had it strung, didn't like how they strung yeah. it. Stopped, restrung it. Ooh, ladies, is it good? And I gotta tell you, the price I stuck on it, 
for Jodo, you want to buy the Peridot necklace because I only did 30 of them. Oh. That's and not a the lot. price is like, so sometimes in Tucson, like, there's people that want to sell it to you all the time and it's like they don't have the quality you want. Yeah. Well, every once in a while, they'll have something where it's like, oh my gosh. So for 30 years, she's been trying to sell to me. I'm like, no, thank you, no. Well, when I did the beads, she had old, old pair that mm -hmm. she'd been sitting on forever. Pricing is super expensive. So just to sell to me, she gave me a price. I And literally, I was like, you got to be kidding me. So we strung it all up. And I had to use two strands, though, because I wanted to get the ladies over a 20. Because that necklace is, it's going to be beautiful. So we will be showing that. That just went to Athena. They had to build it on Accu, and then we'll stick it on Woo. And that's the So period. I think one week. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, because Teresa was asking if it's not ready yet for the August babies, but it sounds like we'll I, have it yeah, yeah, very soon. Yeah, no, so in about <laughs> one week I'll have it. Okay. But the Peridot itself, I know we should have it for August. So save, save like, spoil yourself, but um, yes. It just took us a little bit getting the Peridot stones, and I wanted to do the right designs. Okay. Because Peridot doesn't always look good in all the designs. So yeah. um, I really wanted them to be really special because Peridot, I don't use cheap Peridot, and you can get cheap and affordable Peridot. I want it really spectacular, Mickey, if I do it. Yeah. Okay. So it's going to be a little more pricey than what you see out there. But with, you're getting the quality to, to I had more to, than the quality. Yeah, yeah. I wanted that really something that later they go they get appraised down the road it is going to be something yeah. where you know it's like well this is included this isn't really the top quality but it's paired out it's nice but not really worth anything yeah. um one last question pat this wants to know if there's going to be any more of those madeira citrine bead necklaces the madeira no but ladies the sunstone's going to launch with the peridot so could that help? Yeah, I, I think that might. <laughs> we have two gem, gemstone necklaces. So the sunstone that I was going on and on about, yeah. because I, the, the beading had to be just spot on. So it, it is, but it's going to be a choker length. That one is shorter. Okay. Um, it's going to be a, like right at a 16. 16. Because mm -hmm. mm -hmm. it's, it's edgy cool. It's graduated. It's mm -hmm. like, yeah. yeah. Cool. So... All right. It's my son's birthday, and he said, okay, everybody, well, blessings your way, and it's so great to see you. We will see you tomorrow live, yes. okay, during our live show, and I, I'll, I'll see, uh, see you ladies in person. Yeah, okay? just a reminder, uh, B10 ends tonight, so make sure you get your B2 jewelry purchases in, and the coupon for last chance is oh, Thursday 10. So this one, too. Yes, Thursday 10 uh, saves you 10% off of your purchase of $50 or more, so... Take advantage of those, those both in Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Teresa's saying divorce court, Peridot and Sunstone. What? Yeah. No, this beaded necklace, ladies, like literally, oh, it is so good. I've never seen anything like it in my life. As a matter of fact, my stones, I sent it back and said, and he goes, yeah, you want to pay like $200 a stone? And so I don't even know how I got this deal. So I'm excited. Pass on the value to you, ladies. Okay. See you tomorrow. Bye. Thanks.